Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. So guys, this video is a quick comparison between the Geekbench scores for iOS 17 versus iOS 18 on iPad 7 so that you can simply check out the scores and decide if you want to upgrade from iOS 17 to iOS 18 on iPad 7. So I have already installed Geekbench here on my device and it is freshly restored to iOS 17. You can see it is an iPad 7 generation. So we will first of all check and run a test for Geekbench on iOS 17. So I will select CPU benchmark first and run it. We will wait for the process to finish and we will see the results first for iOS 17. All right, so the test is near completion. All right, now we can see the scores for iOS 17 for the CPU, single core and multi-core. Now let's go back and do the GPU benchmark also. All right, as you can see this test for iOS 17 GPU is also complete. Now we will freshly restore this device iPad 7 to iOS 18 and repeat the test and then we will compare. Now for this test I am restoring this iPad 7 to iOS 18 and you can see it is full restore flash. Now we will wait for this full restore to iOS 18 to finish. iOS 18 freshly restored and I have installed Geekbench on it and it's an iPad 7. I will open it and you can see the version iOS 18 iPad 7 generation. Let's do the CPU benchmark test on iOS 18 on this device. We will wait for the process to finish and then I will share the results. All right, so the test for the CPU benchmark is complete and you can see the results for the single core and for the multi-core. We will go back and do the GPU benchmark. Once it is complete, we will compare the results for iOS 17 and iOS 18. All right, the GPU benchmark result is here for iOS 18. And if I check the GPU tab, you can see them right here. Now, as you can see, the CPU benchmark between iOS 17 being at the left and on the right, we have iOS 18. You can see the single core score has improved. If you check out iOS 18 compared to iOS 17, but with multi-core score, it has dropped. If you compare to iOS 17 on the left on this iPad 7. And if you check about the GPU benchmark, you can see it right here. On the left, we have iOS 17. On the right, we have iOS 18. And the score has dropped for iOS 18 compared to iOS 17 on this iPad 7. That's all for this video, guys. If you still have questions, please ask in the comment section. And I will reply you as soon as possible. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye and take care of yourself.